cap attorney uh, is a voice for the child while they are in foster care. They represent the child's wishes and the desires. They protect their legal rights and interests. There are roughly 3,500 kids in foster care at any given time in Clark County. Even with 26 staff attorneys, obviously we can't represent them all. I believe it all began when my mom, I think she abandoned us in the house. So we got sent to Child Haven for a couple months and then we got put in foster care together. Me, my sister, and my brother, we was all together at once. And then we end up getting out and going right back in. It's actually really hard for foster kids. Like, people who really wouldn't understand what they're going through. It's been our mission to represent every child in foster care, and Mong understands that, and he has tried to instill that, uh, the culture of pro bono with his firm and, and taking a cap case. Mong was really quick at communicating to other community partners in law enforcement when we had a small trespassing citation with Andrea, but he was really quick to get the charges removed and representing her in court. He took that initiative to be that support system to her, not just her legal representation, but also as a support to her. We need that other voice for our youth where we just can't uh, come in on the law side. It was pretty cool that we actually had somebody to defend us. I believe he actually helped us the majority of the time. Mong is so tremendous because of the energy that he creates around the project beyond just himself and he's a real leader. He's a leader within his firm. He's a leader within the CAP program. And without people like that, the program would not be successful. Because of Mong and his support, she is a true success of another youth that has successfully completed her high school. Mong is definitely that type of attorney who works hard, who is dedicated, who is willing to go the extra step for his client and making sure that their voice is represented. Well, one of the things that I was impressed with at the end in an effort to encourage his colleagues to take a pro bono case was that he agreed to be a mentor to them. And not only that, but he agreed to accompany them on their first home visit, uh, I think to help put them at ease and make them feel comfortable. You don't get that uh, very often. Mung highly deserves this. He is a rock star in my eyes. The outcome that I have with Andrea it shows that we can move mountains if we work as a team. Congratulations. Mom, congratulations on receiving this award. You're not just a pro bono attorney to our youth, but you're also a rock star in our eyes. Thank you for all your hard work and dedication. Congratulations, Mung, on receiving this year's Myrna Williams Pro Bono Children's Award. We're really happy for you and are thankful for all that you've done, uh, all that you continue to do, and we look forward to working with you in the future.